Hey everyone, a quick news piece for you to end your weekends. Uh, you guys remember King Zell, that forum user from Reset Era, who actually got a whole bunch of stuff recently right on the latest Nintendo Direct. Not only did he predict or state when the next Nintendo Direct would happen and be right about that, he also said we were going to get Mario Maker 2, which we did get, a 2D Zelda game, which was Link's Awakening, and he also told us that we would get things like Box Boy, which we got, and that was probably the biggest confirmation of some of the things he said. He's also gotten a ton of things right over the past year or two in regards to Switch. In fact, I don't think anything he has actually said has ever been wrong, at least not yet, unless he said he was purely speculating. That being said, he threw something up today over on Reset Era that has the internet talking, and I want to talk about it too. And that is that there are, you know, obviously more games coming to Switch, but one game in particular is something that people should have never expected. And he, when questioned about it, or when people brought up examples like Yakuza being on Wii U, he mentioned, let me rephrase that, something not possible before on a Nintendo platform, and referenced it would be like putting Mario on PlayStation. Yeah that my mind's racing already are we talking halo on switch i know some people are thinking maybe that wouldn't be as surprising because of all the microsoft rumors lately but again uh it's until it happens it would be shocking uh are we talking something like i don't know is last of us 2 gonna come to switch that would be something like mario on playstation-esque god of war on switch uh what are we what are we even talking about i have, I have no idea and I think that's the crazy part that's making everyone speculate. Because when you say this announcement is going to be something like Mario being on PlayStation, but it's just, this is for Nintendo Switch, you I mean, you're immediately thinking of games that you would never possibly think could be on Switch. Obviously, we could be talking about Red Dead Redemption 2 or something like that. But I don't think that's what he's talking about. Because that's a third-party game, and uh, it wouldn't be as shocking to see on Switch as Mario would be to see on PlayStation. Now, we already know the Crash Insane series, that's on, on Switch, so it can't be Crash. Uh, I don't know what kind of announcement would honestly shock me. I mean, anything from Sony's side of thing would be shocking. You know, if we're, if we're talking any Uncharted games, if we're talking Last of Us, if we're talking Death Stranding, like, something that has been Sony exclusive on Nintendo would be very, very interesting. Obviously, from Microsoft's side, it could be Crackdown 3. Uh, I don't know that that would be a good fit, especially with its reputation. But whatever, Crackdown 3 might be a possibility. Halo, Gears of War, uh, something like that could possibly be coming to Switch. I don't know. Uh, it could also just be, I don't know, something out there that, uh, you know, he said wasn't possible on Switch a few years ago. That would assume Wii U era. Are we talking something like The Witcher 3? Are we talking about Cyberpunk 2077? I don't know. Like, there's a lot of possibilities out there. And I'm actually curious to throw this one out at you guys. And you guys tell me what you think this might be what game is coming to switch according to king zell remember this is a rumor so treat it as such until it's actually announced there really isn't anything to say other than huh he's been writing on some stuff so maybe he'll be right this time so the question i have is what do you think it is what would be shocking to you to be on switch that would be as shocking if not equal to or more shocking than super mario brothers appearing on a playstation system that is the question I am posing for you guys to end your weekend. I don't even know what to think at this point. Uh, I think Mar like what it, it has to be Uncharted, right? Like Uncharted would be at that Mario level. Uncharted is so closely connected to uh, you know to, to Sony. I don't know. I am Nathaniel Rubblejans from the Nintendo Prime, and be sure to tune in tomorrow right here at 10 a.m. for the well, the, I guess the. A public posting of our 100th episode of the Nintendo Prime Podcast. We actually have a five Nintendo Switch game giveaway uh, special for that 100th episode, but you have to check out that episode for all of the details and how to enter. Uh, the winner will be selected later this week, or winners, there'll be five winners, uh, will be selected later this week. Also, be sure to tune in tomorrow at 5 p.m. And really, 5 p.m. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, as that is when we are going to be dropping daily Prime News Monday through Friday. So be sure to tune in for all the news recaps tomorrow. And heck, uh, I think we even might start getting um, another video tomorrow out at 1 p.m., uh, but I won't tell you what that video is because I haven't actually made it yet. So uh, stay tuned for that. Uh, I guess 
if there's one thing I can say about my goals for this week, it is to try to be consistent and get you guys the videos when I plan to get them to you. Thank you for tuning in, and I will catch you guys in the next video.